it's a rather bleak day outside today so what a great opportunity to get Mr Churchill to the table here I've just got home from work not long ago so I've set this up for a tournament scenario and uh, yeah, let's take a look at my operating theatre so to speak before I give you a quick rundown of the first conference over here on the left I've got my uh, table where I uh, have my rules and uh, sequence of play which I refer to um, and I have the bots and they're set up over here. At the rear I've got uh, the two triple card card holders with the draw deck at the rear, the leader at the next slot and in the front there is where their draw hand goes. So there's Roosevelt and Churchill and I'm playing Stalin in this uh, scenario. And as I play the cards for each bot I lay them out here uh, to help me keep track of the game and the like. And to the right there is the conference deck with the um, conference cards selected for this round. And over here are the discard cards used in the agenda segment. So that's where the uh, enemy hang out. Over to the right of the main operating board, this is where Stalin and his comrades uh, do all their preparations for their... Uh, time at the table. So here's uh, the leader down at the bottom here. This is uh, the discard slot. This is the draw deck and as I play the draw the cards I'll have my deck out here and I'll just play them out here as well just to uh, see where I'm at. So I operate from there and my enemy operate from over there. Taking a look at the uh, game itself, uh, this is the state of play at the end of the first conference round in the tournament scenario and um, Churchill won the agenda segment and uh, so Stalin went to go first myself and uh, I must say it was a good round, a good conference for me uh, mainly because the um, Roosevelt and Churchill didn't draw very strong hands so I actually managed to win the most uh, number of issues which was um, good and not characteristic of Stalin. Um, and then it came down to um, fronts advancing and um, we had movement on the eastern front moving into the Ukraine. We had no movement on the uh, western front because the uh, second front hasn't been opened yet as an issue. Uh, there was no movement in the Mediterranean. Uh, there was an allied advance into Burma and into Vogelkop, New Guinea. Um, clandestine and political market wise um, I did very well there and managed to get I think it was uh, three clandestine markers down and one political marker so all in all a very strong first round for uh, Stalin so I'm quite pleased with that and uh, yeah so that's um, my operating theatre here with Churchill and um, I'll come back to you with the next conference at some stage as well to see you let you know how that went